So I think we will uh, mostly see uh, uh, do it uh, like this. But uh, the honey detox massage, uh, mostly we do it uh, on the back. But we also saw that it's possible to uh, make it, example, uh, in the face or other part of the body. Uh, but today we'll uh, do the one uh, on the part, on the back part. Uh, so what uh, honey does? Uh, first, we take uh, one teaspoon of honey. Uh, I dry. I, my hands are uh, really clean. So we first, it's important to clean for sure. Uh, and the the person also. Uh, it's better to uh, that the back is clean uh, because if it's after a big effort and uh, the people uh, sweat, it's uh, not the best. So it's better that the person is uh, quite clean too. Uh, so we heat. Uh, you are ready? I'm ready. Yeah, you can. Uh, Should I just come? Yeah, you can okay. come. I'm just gonna back just in people way. don't look at her uh, right now. <laughs> 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 we have sheets here. It's so. Are you comfortable or maybe yeah. you need uh, something? Uh, no, I'm good. Yeah. <coughs> okay. Go. This. I can take it on. Mm -hmm. I'll just I'll get it honey on it. This. <laughs> <Go>. <laughs> And uh, if you have, uh, like we saw in the movie yesterday, uh, something to protect the hair, because sometimes when we work I want mm -hmm. around here, after mm -hmm. when it's stuck in the air, it's not really uh, fun. Um, so uh, you also observe uh, the back, and for sure you have to ask questions first to the patient, because if the person uh, takes chemicals, uh, products, or smoke a lot, uh, maybe the, sometimes uh, there's a... Uh, uh, it could be not uh, really good for the person, so it looked like okay. There's no legends. There's no problem. So here the honey uh, must be uh, raw honey. So this is the one of uh, Yan. I'll try it. Even if the the honey is crystallized, uh, it's not a big deal. You can uh, do it also. So just one teaspoon is enough. Somebody can maybe take the jar and the, the spoon too, please. Thank you. I heat uh, honey like this. Then I put some honey uh, everywhere here. Okay. So there's um, mainly five different movements you do. So we begin uh, with the, the one who is not uh, that strong. It's just the tip of the fingers. So something like this. So it's a sucking uh, effect. So you see that the the skin is uh, coming in a little bit with the honey. So this is the first movement. The second one is uh, with uh, the all fingers, like this. So a, a little bit more, more heat. So usually for the first time, uh, the first um, appointment, uh, it could be only 15 minutes. But then if the person become uh, more and more used to it, you can uh, you do 15 minutes, then you wait other 15 minutes. You can go until three or four times. So the third uh, movement, it's uh, the wave-like, like this. That's my favorite one. <laughs> so honey, it's a good nutrient for the body. 
and uh, you see also that uh, it will heat and so it's good for uh, blood circulation but also for lymphatic circulation so you try to go everywhere how does it feel it feels like it's definitely pulling the skin up. <laughs> <laughs> it feels nice. Oh, good. Oops, there's a hair. <laughs> You see that there's a area who becomes red, it's uh, totally yeah. normal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is uh, not normal is when it stays white, it means there's like blockage, block. It's, uh, the energy is blocked. So let's see. So it becomes uh, stickier and stickier. <laughs> Tell me if uh, it's too much. No, it's still good. Okay. So I, I, I can feel it's getting more. Uh, yeah. Uh, the fourth movement, uh, it's uh, you put your fingers like, like this, and you, it's like little uh, vatus, uh, suction, suction cup. Suction cup. Yeah. So sometimes, if you see that there's a white spot, you can uh, accentuate more with uh, this movement. But it's not my favorite. Uh, you see there's uh, some white stuff who is uh, uh, coming in, out. It's uh, really normal. Uh, there's a lot of uh, sebaceous, uh, uh, like fat uh, from the sebaceous glands will come out. But there's also some dead cells, for sure. And when you do it more and more, the, you can also take off uh, like uh, chemicals, uh, toxic uh, stuff. Okay. And the last uh, movement, uh, I'm not going to do it a long time, it's pretty hard. Uh, it's uh, with all your hand like this. So you see... Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But this, this one is... It feels a little bit like a waxing. Yeah, yeah. 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 And it feels really invigorating, actually. Can you feel the heat? Nope. No. But after it would be a little bit like a sunburn, the mm -hmm. feeling. Mm -hmm. And the back uh, stays uh, red uh, for a little while, but it's really, really soft then. And how often do you do like uh, every several days or? Yeah, it depends uh, week, for uh, what reason, for sure. No, no, I but mean for just a healthy to recover. Person, yeah, no, yeah. Healthy. For a healthy person, it's fine, maybe once a month or, oh, so, okay. or so. Oh, yes. Like, yeah, you do it on the legs? Uh, yes, you can do it everybody, everywhere in the body. But uh, some uh, parts who are more sensitive, you go uh, gentle, like with the tips. Uh, like this. Okay. So how long a session before you get tired? Me? Yeah. <laughs> uh, depends on the person. Depends on big and, uh, so, and we have to also want to uh, move from another from a side to another to the table. Make sure we don't work on yeah, one place, but do yeah. it uh, oh, homogeneous everywhere on the body. Yeah. You see it's uh, red in the middle, it's, it stays uh, white, so I, I will work a little bit more in the middle. Are you feeling still good? Yeah. Yeah. So you see uh, that's a lot of creamy mm -hmm. stuff. You can approach some people who are, uh, you can just change place. So now it's really, really sticky. Mm -hmm. Good. Take photos. Many photos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you. Look, it's, uh, I think it's good for the, the first time, like this. Mm -hmm. So then I will need uh, water? Uh, hot uh, 
Yeah, towel. Hot towel. Warm towel. No, that didn't take long. No. Four is a nice and open. Obviously. Is there lots of white stuff? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe I forgot to tell her maybe to uh, uh, move a little bit yeah, to work on the low back also. So I, I mostly work on the high part, but uh, it was maybe an error. To, it's better to have the bigger part maybe. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so then it's uh, because the pores of the skin are open, it opens the pores. Uh, it's important that during the same day not having uh, uh, shampoo or soap, uh, just uh, a shower with uh, water is enough. Uh, uh, make sure the products will not uh, enter into the skin. Okay. So, uh, so the, just the next day. The honey draws the toxic out? Yeah. Um, and like I said, uh, also, the show some. Which one? The one that nourishes the nourishment going in as well. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want more water to rinse? Yeah, I think so. Maybe one more. One more. Okay, see if it goes on. No matter when you batter honey, it gets kind of thick. That's not what it is. And the honey gets warm and then gets kind of pasty. Depends on this. There's like more on her back than these Is it too hot? Yeah. No. Wash it well. <coughs> yeah. What I do uh, sometimes uh, before the massage, uh, I make an uh, infusion of uh, chamomile, chamomile mm -hmm. and with uh, in a spray, so just to, to clean a little bit, so there's less uh, dead cells it's, uh, and it's cleaner, so you can go deeper to bring some uh, toxin out, so it's a little trick. Uh, what about warming up the skin, like with a warm towel, what about doing that before you start? Uh, maybe it's a good idea, yeah. To, uh, do you do this massage at your place? Uh, I don't. No, I do it on my friends and my <laughs> family, but uh, I, uh, it's not uh, something that I do right now. So, where? And I uh, once I was traveling in uh, Brazil, and I did the the honey massage, but down there is the weather is so hot that the, there's no white stuff coming out. It always stays like. Uh, Honey, so here because it's colder uh, weather, it's a little bit different. So where the the more the more you do, where the the white stuff coming less or? Uh, it, more. it depends on uh, the the person too. Uh, if she uh, ate uh, hot dogs uh, <laughs> for uh, I don't know. It depends also. And the, the, the period that you do it, uh, I said it's about uh, 15 minutes. It would be 12 to 15 minutes. Uh, but sometimes, uh, like w one time, I tried to somebody who took uh, pills like for uh, psychos, and uh, uh, maybe uh, when it's a big uh, disease like that, and she was not feeling well, uh, I said, okay, I just made like uh, three minutes. Then I did a little bit on, on the legs, so more like a general thing than just uh, a lot of uh, energy at the same place like this. So depending on the mood of the person, the, the, uh, how what she, the person eat or uh, smokers, so you have always to, to uh, ask questions before doing it. Okay, the dry ones like this. So then you let the person relaxing for five minutes, something like this, and then you can do it again. So you take some more uh, new honey, you can do it another 15 minutes until four times, like I said. Mm -hmm.